today we will see the next topic approximations from the applications of derivatives uh, if f of x is a differentiable function of x then we can find its derivative at the particular point x is equal to a and is given by f dash at a is equal to limit h tends to 0 f of a plus h minus f of a upon h this is known as the derivative by using the first principle now here uh, this uh, equal to and the two dots below and above this have sign is used for approximation this is not e exactly equal to this is approximately equal to now this definition is valued if h tends to zero so h is very 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 small it approaches to zero but it is not equal to zero so for sufficiently small h we can remove this limit and this equality will be loose and it is approximately equal to so after simplifying this you can write f of a plus h is approximately equal to f of a plus h f dash at a and this is the formula that we are going to use for evaluating the approximate value of the given function just look at this formula and keep in your mind f of a plus h is approximately equal to f of a plus h f dash at a <clears throat> so let us see solve example on this approximation this is the first example find the approximate value of root 64.1 now always we have to search a, a function which associate to the uh, which link to the given problem now here is square root okay square root of something is given 64.1 so i will uh, take the function as root x okay so what is the my function f of x is equal to root x is my function so differentiate with respect to x we get f dash of x is equal to 1 upon 2 root x so here now we have to search a number we have to locate a number which, which is nearer to this 64 and whose square root we know so obviously we have to choose 64 as it is a square root of 8 so root choose a is equal to 64 and h is equal to 0 0.1 so we will put x is equal to a in both f of x as well as in f dash of x to find the values of f of a and f dash at a so f of a is 8 and f dash at a is 1 upon 60 <clears throat> so what is the formula to find the approximate value f of a plus h is approximately equal to f of a plus h f dash at a put the values in this formula and simplify you will get uh, f of 64.1 is equal to square root of 64.1 and is approximately equal to 8.00625 so this is the uh, square root of root 64.1 now the next example is we have to find the approximate value of 3.98 raised to 3 so here we have to choose x cube x cube so we will take the function f of x is equal to x cube we will differentiate this function with respect to x f dash of x is equal to 3x square we will take here a as 4 and h is minus 0 0.02 so f of a means f of 4 is 4 cube which is 64 and we will put a is equal to 4 in f dash at a so f dash at a is f dash at 4 is 3 times 4 square so 4 square is 16 and 16 threes are 48 now take the formula to find the approximate value f of a plus h is approximately equal to f of a plus h f dash at a put the values in this formula and simplify it so 64 minus 0 0.96 that is 63.04 this is the cube of 3.98 find the approximate value of sine of 30 degree and 30 minutes 
given that one degree is 0.0175 radian and the cos 30 is 0.866. So obviously as <coughs> you have to choose the function sin x, f of x will be sin x and its derivative is cos x. Now here it is not given the uh, full degree. So 30 degrees given and uh, 30 minutes. Now this 30 minutes is nothing but uh, half degree. We can convert this minute into degrees by dividing it by 60. So pi uh, 30 degrees. So 30 degrees pi by 6 radian and one half degree is nothing but 0 0.0175 upon 2 radian. So you get pi by 6 into 0 0.00875. So we have to choose A as uh, pi by 6 and H as 0.00875. We will find the value of f of x at x is equal to pi by 6. It is 1 by 2 because sin pi by 6 is 1 by 2. 1 by 2 is nothing but 0 0.5. And the derivative at the same point pi by 6 is cos pi by 6. It is 0 0.866. Take the formula to find the approximate value f of a plus h is approximately equal to f of a plus h f dash at a. So f of uh, pi by 6 plus uh, 0 0.00875 radian is approximately equal to f of pi by 6 plus 0 0.00875 into f dash at pi by 6. So using these values in this formula f of 30 degree and 30 minutes is approximately equal to 0 0.5 plus 0 0.00875 into 0 0.866 that is approximately equal to 0 0.5 plus 0 0.075775 so what is the value so the value of the sine 30 degree and 30 minutes is 0 0.575775 now the next example is find the approximate value of tan inverse of 0 0.99 and given that pi is 3.1416 here you have to choose the function tan inverse of x this fractional part is always be replaced by x so that we obtain the function so let f of x is equal to tan inverse of x now its derivative is 1 upon 1 plus x square so here we have to choose a is equal to 1 and h is equal to 0 point minus 0 0.01 because why we have to choose 1 because 1 is very close is approximately equal to 0 0.99 so we have to choose a is equal to 1 then we will find the value of f of x and f dash of x at the point a is equal to 1 then we use the definition of approximation and formula of approximation and put those values in this formula so after simplifying will pi by 4 minus 0 0.005 but what is pi? Which the value is given that uh, 3.1416 upon 4 minus 0 0.05. So after division, we get 0 0.7854 minus 0 0.005. So after taking the subtraction, we will reach to the step 0 0.7804. So f of uh, 0 0.99 is approximately equal to 0 0.7804. Four, that is tan inverse of 0 0.99 is approximately equal to 7804. Now moving further, the next example is uh, we have to find the approximate value of e raised to 1.005 where e is 2.7183. Obviously the power function is e raised to x. Its derivative is again e raised to x. So we are, you have to choose a is equal to 1 and h is equal to 0 0.005. Then we will find the value of f of x and f dash of x at x is equal to 1. It comes out to be e that is 2.7183 or 8212. So the approximation formula f of a plus h is approximately equal to f of a plus h f dash at a. Put those values in this formula and simplify you will get the approximate value as 2.73818915 so f of 1.005 is approximately equal to 2.7318915 that means e is to 1.005 is approximately equal to 2.7318915 now the next example is 
find the approximate value of log of 998 to the base 10 log of 998 to the base 10 it is given that log of e to the base 10 is 0 0.4343 now what is the function log of x to the base 10 we can write it as by using the base change for property log of x upon log of 10 but this uh, log of 10 to the base e and she shifted to the numerator uh, by taking the reciprocal change of base and the change of the number log of e to the base 10 into log of x so differentiate this function with respect to x we get uh, as this log of e to the base 10 is constant so we have to find the derivative of only log x it is 1 upon x but it is given that log of e to the base 10 is 0 0.4343 so you will use that uh, value here so f dash of x is 0 0.4343 to the base to upon x. Now we will choose a as 1000 and h is minus 2. And at the same time we will find the value of f of x and f dash of x at the, this a is equal to 1000. Now f of 1000 is same as log of 1000 to the base 10. Now we can write this 10, 1000 as 10 cube and we can take that cube to the uh, front by using the index property of the logarithm so we get 3 log of 10 to the base 10 also we have the property log of a to the base a is 1 log of a to the base a is 1 so using that property you get f of a is equal to 3 similarly we will find the value of the derivative at a is equal to 1000 so again we have to shift 3 decimal points to the left now use the approximation formula f of a plus h is approximately equal to f of a plus h f dash at a put those values in this formula you will reach to the step log of 998 to the base 10 is approximately equal to 2.9991314 you can restrict uh, there are four decimal places only 2.9991 the next solved example is find the approximate value of f of x is equal to x cube plus 5x square minus 2x plus 3 at x is equal to 1.98. Already you have given the function and we have to find this value of this function at, at this point 1.98. Simply you can put this 1.98 in this uh, in, uh, in place of x and sim after simplifying you will get the value but uh, we are going to evaluate this by using the application using the derivatives okay so take your f of x differentiate with respect to x then we will take a closer number closer integer which will be nearer to this uh, decimal or the fractional number so take a is equal to 2 and h is equal to minus 0 0.02 so that their uh, addition is 1.98 so we'll find the value of f of x at this x is equal to 2 Similarly, we will find the derivative of f of x at x is equal to 2. And then finally, we will use the formula for approximation. So f of a plus h is approximately equal to f of a plus h f dash at a. Put a is equal to 2 and h is equal to minus 0 0.02. So after simplifying, you get 27 minus 0 0.02 into 30. So the approximate value is 27 minus 0 0.6. So the approximate value is comes out to be 26.4. So this is the, all about the approximation. Solve examples based on the approximation. In next lecture, we will solve our exercise 2.2, which will based on this approximations only.